So well, welcome to the deepest part of Surrey here as Maystone continue their hunt for a promotion playoff place. Um, today's visitors, oh, today we are visiting Farnborough, the form side of the National League South. I've got Piers Gray alongside me, so Piers, welcome, and what are you Good expecting afternoon, this afternoon? Nigel. Yeah, no, I'm looking forward to it. I'm hoping for a positive performance from Maidstone. Obviously, Farnborough in cracking form at the moment. Seven wins on the trot, so they'll be looking to make that eight and uh, and get into the playoffs themselves. But it was important we come with a positive performance today and, you know, grab, hopefully try and grab a result and, uh, yeah, secure that, that playoff place today. Referee just says it's uncontested. Waving the Farnborough players away. Quite vocal farmer <laughs> fan to our right, isn't there? We said the news going to be coming up. Walter back post, foul takes a touch, tries to play a cross, Taylor comes out well there. Just yeah, really, that really nice ball into the box there. You think that Mo Fowl would have hit that first time, but he took took a touch and just just a little bit too close to the to the keeper. But good chance, good start here for Maidstone. Yeah, it's now with foul again on the edge of the box, running it to the byline, puts the ball in, looking for a head of far, uh, Maidstone player rush. Comes to collect at the second hand, leads it to Corn. Corn has a shot, blocked by the final player. Comes back out to Corn. Corn tries to ball to Tianga. Tianga squares it back. Oh, oh but Bentley just can't. Yeah, no, really positive play for Mason. Definitely been the side on top in the last sort of three, four minutes. Right arm raised, ball comes in. Corn. Brown! Oh, oh what good a save, save there by, by Turner. Jack Turner. That is a fantastic save. Ray Brown really leapt up there. Fantastic ball into the box. Looked like he was bound for the back of the net, and Jack Turner's call once again as the ball comes back into the, their own half. It's now Rafe Brown chasing down the ball over on that far side. And a really good show of pace there from Rafe Brown to, to put him under pressure. Farmer back to the keeper. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> Coughlin did well there. A heart yeah, in mouth, he came out, realised he was on the edge of his area, headed yeah. the ball, but... Both sides looking to go down the wings, aren't they? They're both yeah, they no, attacks down the side. Yeah. And I haven't seen much of the trying to get to no foul, but I say that, the ball's gone, the ball's just gone straight to him. Uh, Sam Corn with the ball over the top, Chian's on in with the run, over by the corner flag, Chian's on in, just looking to stand his man up. Goes one way, goes the other. Try, three on and Chi with the ball. Chi into the box now. Chi, she ends on and she's going to shoot. Oh, oh, it's just blocked. No. And it's going to be brought away here by Haig. Straight into a dangerous area. Nice thing, just got to have their wits about him here. Booty's up, flicked out. Oh, Looking for Ruff, it's going to come back in again by Pendlebury. Ball's headed in, headed away and behind for a corner. I don't, know what, I don't know what's better to concede a corner Ray or a throw in there doing that. Still work to be done here for Maystone. Corner played short. Coughlin. Oh. Coughlin came the out of that ball there. No, it's Corn with his hand up. Referee blows his bit of ball, comes in. Headed out, foul. It's Greenwich. Greenwich just got a touch but couldn't control it towards the goal it's Papaya tries to play Corn in and the ball does find Corn Corn checks and he's looked for Greenwich at the back post but it, no one's in the middle Bivis Garoum calls a shoot as yeah. came out to Bivis and we all know why he calls a shoot out to Papaya Papaya plays the ball in once again Reese Greenwich is back there plays it down foul turns but can't make contact rush surely rush oh, oh Turner save. once again Ball's all the over ball's the place dancing the about still, it can't be cleared by Farnborough. Punts the ball down midway inside the Farnborough, headed away by Pruti. Matthew Williams tries to bring in Haig here. Haig under the attention of Brown. Still Brown under with Haig. Plays it back. It's been on the edge of the area, good chance here for Farnborough, and it's into the side oh, netting. I say a throw, but it's more like a corner, really, isn't it? It is, yeah. He's come across to take this. The number six for Farnborough. And the throw down the line by Rafe Brown. And it's going to be 
Bentley now, doing growing there, trying to win the ball. But it's going to be Farber that's come away of it. Farber now just trying to get into the Maystone box. Held up well there by Tanga. But still with the Maystone, the uh, Farber player, Neville Williams. He can't get more from the box. 25 shoots. And it's way over. over on that one. Bentley just tries to peel away now. Greenwich at the back post. For another one of those back post headers that he's good at. Ball comes into the back post. Brown! Just couldn't make contact with the ball there. It's the second time Ray Brown's been in there and had a chance with a header into the goal, but um, that ball just had a bit too much pace. He's defending there, it's going to be another corner it. to Maystone. Matt Rush wants to get him his shirt, Paul, but managed to throw the ball back to Pibbage. Pibbage tries to play the ball over the top to Tianga, but he can't win it, and it's he's Brown, Brown plays it against the players. Bit of a mistake here, but bounced kindly. Brown still with Haig. Still with Farnborough here on the edge of the area. It's come back to Haig. Haig's looking for a chance to shoot. Haig shoots. But he there, shoots like against. Lee's Glennie has gone out for a corner. Farnborough, it's going to be a Maystone throw. Pyre takes, flicked on by Bentley to foul. Foul back to goal. Tanga in on the edge of the box here. Tanga still with the ball. Tanga plays it back to Birish Gurung. Birish plays it out to Sam Corn. Ball into the box. Oh, just right in the hands of Turner there. Uh, good play there from Tanga. Knocks back out. So. It's going to be a long throw from ends on him. Takes a run up at it. Makes it into the box. Flicked on. No one there for Maystone. Doesn't quite pose the threat. As, yeah, uh, it's the farmer long throw, does it? It's not a bit. Tanga's done well there to get that ball. Good strength there. Just, just plays it down to Bivish. Bivish plays it inside to the on rushing Rafe Brown. He plays it back to Tanga inside the area. Tanga turns one play. Tanga oh. caught down. No, he's now the ball there. I don't think. I think it was right there, could right been, behind it. Could have been something. He's going to try and put a long one in. He takes the run up. Long one does come in. He's headed up into the air. It's bouncing around. Oh, Turner just manages to fall onto that ball. So it is a corner to Maystone. Sam Corn's going to take. Over on that far side. Sam Corn with the corner. In it comes now. Both Brown! Scores for Maidstone! Just killed off his man there! Get in. Yeah, he was bound to happen. He's, he's, he's had two great chances this game, Rafe Brown. To, similar to the to the first chance he had. Jack Turner made an excellent save. An outswinging corner from, from Sam Corn and truly deserved to truly deserved to go. Yeah, he has he had a really good game today. Oh, slip there from Chief. Mate, Farber looking to break here. Ball headed up, Greenwich still with Farber. Men, men back now for Maystone. It's with Jack, with Haig. He falls onto that ball, it's cleared by Maystone as far as Rush. Rush now. Ball become a little bit frantic this last five minutes as Farber looked to respond. And it's... Uh, Maystone just looking to try and take a little bit of pace out of this ball with a long clearance by Kovlin and it's Puku. Adu Puku tries to chip the oncoming Taylor oh. Turner but it's just got out for a goal kick. <laughs> so it's corner's going to come in from Farnborough. Kovlin punch punches there, up into the air. He's going to have a shot here but can't get it on target. We're in the 88th minute now. Clock ticks down, Joe Turner with a throw. And it's going to be Tanga that's going to collect here. But Tanga with the ball forward, looking for the run of Solway just Smith. Solway just Smith gets there. He's done well there keep on that it in? He does keep it in. Over into the corner flag, plays it back for Sam Bone. Bam, plays it to Tanga. Tanga shoots! Oh! Yeah, a really nice play there from Mainstone. It's gone on that far side with Solway and Joe Smith. with the ball over the top 
pulls a corner flag. Wanjo Smith gives chase. Wanjo Smith wins the ball, but he can't. Yeah, he's done well there. Done well so. there. Wanjo Smith plays it back for Adu Puku. Oh, oh. Save. oh. It's a corner to Farnborough. Ball comes in, bobbling around. Cleared by Adu Puku. Goalie's right up inside his own half. And there it is, that's the final oh, whistle. whistle. Kind of caught everyone by surprise there. And I think not, I we haven't really played the five minutes yet, but that's it. It's the final score here. It's Farnborough nil, Maidstone 1, and Maidstone has secured their playoff place.